So we gonna we gonna. Call it was it really time. good though. I th- I think it got good. It got good. That it's first it's episode very interesting. That first episode was crazy. First episode was trash to me. Wait, you know. was trash? Yeah, I, I loved it. it. You loved it? I loved it. Uh, yeah. Hello. Yes, sir. Yeah, man. So we're here. We're talking about power. What'd you think about the first episode? Because Cat said she loved it. I absolutely hated it until I found out. Uh, what's her, what's what's her name? What's her name? Lauren. Paige her Lauren. Lauren. When I found out Lauren was alive, that's when I liked the episode. <laughs> I felt like she was already alive. <laughs> you never felt like she was dead. <laughs> no, they never showed when she actually killed her. Yeah. Episode one, I give it a D. I feel like because the thing is, number one, you got the Wakandan uh, crime mob that came in. Who are these niggas? Wakanda, Wakanda. <laughs> bro. No, oh my god! I was like, what? They're trying to just add some that that blew my mind because I was like, that is making that's just throwing off the um the whole power because that doesn't even make any sense. I didn't like it. Any part of it, and it was like they're too, they're too, they were too much, too much killing them white people in the <laughs> park. Y'all just don't care about anything. And then they were they 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 were Africans. I'm like, why do they have to be? Africans? Yeah, of course. That's why I said the Wakanda because you can't even do where in Africa are these people from? Nobody knows they're from Wakanda. And that ring was definitely not for her. So that's why I know that somebody messed up on the script because that ring was for what's that girl name? That lady, uh, uh, Monet. Monet. Yeah. Yeah. So what where did she come from? I Talking think, about that's her ring. I just feel like they're they're sticking to this whole thing where there has to be some Something insane new. crime boss that is just ferocious that it was the Serbs, it was the Mexicans. You know, it was always somebody that they were trying to get out from underneath. Oh, oh, Go ahead. I, I think I skipped too far. Okay. But when it came to that white boy. Who? Brayden? Brayden. We're doing what? That, when Kane told him to, you know, kill somebody yes. or whatever. That was the dumbest scene ever because also why would you tell him to go over there knowing that he hangs around y'all? Mm-hmm. If dumb people were supposed to be doing business with you and exactly. they come back around and they spot him, exactly. what do you think is going to happen? Well, that was a that was problematic. And then on top of that, why is he... I don't understand. Last season, they made him look like he wasn't scared and he was with all the bullshit. Like he was doing everything. Well, last season, he did not, do, he did not kill anybody. Well, he didn't last, kill anybody. He was doing he that was, for Kane. He was robbing people. He was putting guns in people's faces and all that. I don't remember that. You don't remember that? Mm-mm. Asad, do you remember? The white boy? I definitely remember that. Braden was doing, Braden was putting in work. Now he's freezing up when it's time to, to catch but a But he body. can never, he can never shoot though. He's never shot. Uh, I don't, you right. I don't want to jump ahead, but it's like, okay, so this nigga Braden, he, he, uh, he gets, he, what does he plead to some low, low charge because of how influential his family is. Okay. Mm-hmm. That's, that's cool. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And the first fucking black woman that we see there, he smashed. Oh yeah, I, no, 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 no. That, that was it. It was unreal because let's 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 go back to that. Let's unpack that. So number one, she's complaining about the racist white dude at the job. He gets him fired, and she just grabs him and just fucks him. Come like, on, that's a thank you. I guess hey, look, I don't no, know. No, no, like, not. Okay, let's go out to dinner. Let's get drinks after this. Maybe let's fuck tonight. No, we're going to fuck right now at the office. I thought she was about to show him something. This lady goes and shows him in between her legs. Yeah, just straight to the pussy. Like, Jesus Christ. (laughs) That just, that happened way too bad. And that's unrealistic, bro. Come on now. Very. And they're not dating. At all. And there's no, they didn't even have no interaction. They're not doing that. (laughs) (laughs) He just fucked her. Come on. Got one guy fired. Fucked her. Jesus Christ. Yeah, that. I don't even know if he has AIDS. She could have fucking AIDS. I mean, people don't care about that. You are annoying. <laughs> We're living in a world where no one gives a damn about that. Jesus Christ. Now, are we all in conclusion? Amal, Am- Amate, Safute, whatever the fuck. Who that nigga Ashe Jackson, whatever the nigga name is? The nigga who, yeah. who's trying to talk to Diana. I hope he the woke nigga. Huh? The nigga who's talking to oh, Diana. Yeah. He's one of the corniest human beings. Very corny and don't know how to act. And half gay, at least. <laughs> he does not know how to act. Uh, every scene he's in is annoying. He keep and and every every space, facial expression he has, he's smiling. He can be mad. He can <laughs> be angry. Smiling. He can be happy. We you never know, but this man always got a little smirk on his face. And I'm just like, where did he come from? Yeah, he's like a- who put him, who hired him to play this part? That's, Diana, she's so scumbag. She's so low. I loved her so much. <laughs> Why is she a scumbag? Because she's 
I mean, she, I, somebody she, stole her her nigga. Uh, if you recall, she's mad at the other girl. She's mad at whatever her name is, Effie. Th- this is what girls do when they lose. Hassan, this is what girls do when they lose their mind, bro. That don't make no sense. And her brother just died, so you got to think. About she's that. gonna lose her mind. You know, she's gonna fuck with the bitch ass nigga. It's usually what happens. And her dad just threw her under the bus. What's gonna happen if she gonna choose the game? She's about to go to jail. She's gonna go to jail. You think? I I have a good feeling she's gonna go to jail. Cat is predicting a, a jail sentence for Diana. What do you think about that, Asad? She's not going to jail. I think it's possible. She's gonna go to jail. Somebody's you going why? to jail. Tariq can't keep going to jail. Somebody's got to go. She's gonna go to jail because I feel like she's the person that's supposed to um, make the family look better. You mm-hmm. know, she's supposed to go to school, finish school, da 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 da. And her dad was supporting her. Now her dad just dumped a whole bag of whatever is in there. For her to sell Like mm-hmm. why would you do that Folks ain't going to jail Motherfuckers is dying Who's going to jail Somebody's going Somebody to go to, go to jail, jail for bro that. Cause Kane uh, Kane think he know what he doing But he really don't He moving He moving He's reckless, reckless yeah. Like mm-hmm. You know who might go to jail You know who might fuck around Go to jail Method man Who The lawyer He might fuck around Go to jail Oh that, yeah he might You know what That's a dark horse I think I think that yeah Cause that, if that's they take possible. him out If they take him out the game They're done that's what's really holding like a little glue for them. I don't think he's going to jail though, because you got to think about it. Proctor didn't go down until when? Yes, but his brother is in jail, and that the other dude that's working for him knows that you, he's. You know what's going to happen? What? This is what's going to happen. Sax is going to finally die. Yeah, he's he's definitely because he's doing too much. <laughs> he's doing too much. And you're on both sides. You're on both sides, and then when the lawyer, when Method Man fi- figure out like, okay, he's gonna blow the whistle, or he thinks he's anything, he's, he's gonna, gonna kill let, him. He's gonna let Tariq know. Hey, listen, Sax has got to go. <laughs> and it's like you, be you, body. you're digging too much. Like you went in this man's office, took the phone, called, and are you dumb? You said what is that? Dying around Tariq, bro. There's so many people. No, die, no, bro. we keep saying that, and people are gonna keep dying, bro. So there's no way around I it. I mean, he said it. He said everybody dies around me. So, <laughs> bro, it's gonna keep. There's no way. There's we don't have a show if bodies don't keep. Why do you think Tariq. that? She, why you think she's hiding Lauren? Why? Do, why do I think she's hiding Lauren? Because, because she, she feel- wants. She wants Lauren to to cooperate. No, I think she wants Tariq to break. Because oh if Tariq, if if Tariq, okay, so Lauren, Lauren is out the picture, right? Yeah, right. Effie now. is in the picture right now. Effie's his girl. That's who's holding him down. Yeah, you know he's gonna break if he knows. If Lauren's he finds alive. out, he's gonna forget everybody. That's what I'm saying. He's so, such a bitch ass nigga. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he was in love with Lauren. Like, I mean, but how can you not be in love with Effie? How can you not be in love with Diana too? What a, he, what but a he, real he, lo- he loves. I know he loves Lauren. Just like his care. father loves Angela. He don't need no more. He don't need no more roughness. He got all that in him. So mm-hmm. Effie, she's like a little man. She's no, not, no, no, no. Effie is not long term. <laughs> we know that. She's Effie's like not a little man. Long-term. But Lauren, he loved that girl from top to top to bottom. So I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. It's hard, but it's weird that she's holding her. Like I want to know what the and then she didn't tell her parents. I want to know what it's going to be like when we find out. She might just escape though. What do you think about that? I think they're going to sue the f- out of that lady. You can't do that. You can't hold that girl like that. That's not even the the police station though. Well, yeah, you you have to you would have to consent to something like exactly. that. exactly. And I don't think she did. She's just holding her like without no papers. I think she's going to escape. Potentially, and then it's gonna. This whole thing is gonna bust open. I think that dude, the one that looks like Sax, I don't know his name. He's under oh, the other, other the cop, the cop that stopped Monet and busted window. Yeah, yeah, that bitch ass cop. What is his name? I don't know. What's okay. his name? You know his name? I don't What's know that? his name. I don't know. Fuck him. Bitch ass yeah, cop. <laughs> <laughs> he, I think he's going to fight Lauren because he's doing his investigation. Because he was like, because he's trying, Lauren to, he's is trying not, to nail Monet. Yeah, he said, "Why are we not looking for who killed Lauren? Why are we not looking for who?" Da 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 da. And she's just like, she she's trying to block it. Like she's like, just leave. Lauren. Hey, that was a suicide hey, or some shit. Because like, nobody knows who killed Lauren. Because nobody killed Lauren. Exactly, but technically i mean we know who tried to kill her but then also she has memory loss so if her memory of that night never comes no back, she said effie no she didn't say yes that. she did she what said did she i told that? you who tried to kill me. lauren said that no 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 no. she believes effie tried to kill her she doesn't remember that effie tried to kill her she said Braden. she said Braden did it 
No, no she didn't she, say Brayden's name. When the hell did she say that? She said Brayden took the charge for the the drugs or whatever. But she's she's trying to figure out how Effie. No, I, no she did say Effie. She did say Effie. That's what I'm saying. She but said she Effie. said she believes it's Effie, right? And the, the of course the the attorney bitch believes it's Tariq. She wants it to be Tariq. She wants it to, and this is the same mistakes that. See, this is my problem with the show, though. It's they're literally just carbon copying what was happening in the first show by saying, "Okay, the police got a hard on for Tariq so much, the same way they had it for Ghost, that they're trying to pin shit on him that he didn't do." You see what I'm saying? It's and always the, the same thing. Then there's some psychopathic, uh, a drug bitch. plug they got that's trying to kill him. You know, it's all, it's the same and then the ladies. thing. Then there's these girl, the love triangle, love diamond. Let's call it a diamond, yeah. right? Yeah. It's the same fucking show. And I'm just like, y'all niggas can deviate a little bit. God damn. Well, they did deviate. Now, what? Now they got a nigga. <laughs> they got Wakanda. <laughs> wait, wait. Oh, and them folks. Now, now they have a homosexual, is what you're saying, in Drew. <laughs> yes. Oh, my God. I saw that. I, they, they I'm like, just, man, they just as easily, Valley, oh my they, God. They just as easily could have just had dude walk out. That scene of him walking out would have let us know that Drew's having sex with random guys. We didn't have to see the sex scene. That was a random guy? Yeah, that was a random guy. I wasn't Everett. That was a random He's on the damn apps hooking up. That was a, I'm thinking that was, uh, what's his name? The, whoever he's talking to, the basketball player. No, Everett left him, remember? Yeah, I thought they. I thought they was just. Nah, Everett's done. So, but the tattoo that I saw, I don't know if y'all were paying attention. What tattoo? It was a tattoo. Whoever I don't know if he was supposed to be having like seen another dude. It was mm -hmm. a tattoo that he he pulled up on his phone right after they were done doing whatever they were. No, doing. He, was he was looking at Everett. He was looking at Everett's Instagram or whatever. Who's Everett? Everett is the one who he was fucking with, the the basketball nigga. Yes, but the the tattoo was not his. The tattoo was the dude that came brought those three guys, the the four brothers upstairs. All oh, the gay. He had it on his arm. That's yeah, what he was because, looking at. Because that nigga is gay too. The with the one brother, mm -hmm. the Puerto Rican one. That nigga gay too. So that's not him on the in the photo. I don't know. That's what I'm saying. I'm, I, I, I was confused. I got because that go was the same exact there. tattoo. Probably was then. It's probably finna be something with them two niggas. No. Not if he messing with Everett. He's not though. Everett's the gone. Everett went to Oklahoma City to play basketball. Oh. He's done. Thank God. What is it? Yeah, but, only, but the gay scenes aren't gonna stop. That's the unfortunate. Yeah, they're thing. not gonna they're stop. They're not they're not gonna stop. It's just somebody else. <laughs> we tag, just know we tag. just know we know what time to go to the kitchen. As soon as we see that. Uh <laughs> whatchamacallit. Um what else? But yeah, that first episode, I just feel like it was just like too much. Everything was happening so fast. All of a sudden, you guys are a million dollars in dope debt with some Wakandans. We don't know what that's about. You stop calling. No, they're from Wakanda. Them is not like no. They're from a fictitious country. They're not from any real. Aside, <laughs> it's some dude on Clubhouse that Joel been arguing with. And he told him the way he's talking. He said that's not even an accent. Like that's not a real accent. Then there's no place where people talk like that. That's them niggas. Yes, they do. Where? I don't know, but her name is I'm, actually Ebo. For real? No, ma. Okay, she's probably they're probably, but the actress probably is Ebo, probably. Because a lot of a lot of them actresses from Britain is Ebo. You said what? Yeah, she's a London. She's from London. Yeah, London, but like you know, they got a lot of Africans in London and Jamaicans. <laughs> this man said London. London. <laughs> uh, so that happened. What? And then we got this thing with Monet. She's going to find out Lorenzo killed Zeke. I mean, yeah, Kane sloppy. already knows, and he's very sloppy. Yeah, he's sloppy as hell. And we can. We he's very, very sloppy. And I think actually, who's about to find out is the daughter. You're right. She's, she's gonna she's, figure it out. She's gonna, and that's why I say I feel like something's going to happen with her. Wow. Because she's probably gonna try to figure out why is my dad? My dad sent me to school. Mm -hmm. Boom, boom, boom. I just don't feel like I don't feel comfortable with him giving her that that. Drug or whatever. I feel like something's gonna happen. She, she's gonna start figuring stuff out. Cause it, she even even Drew. Drew was supposed to be um the boss. The boss, and uh -huh. he said it in front of him, and he was like, "Uh, so what's his name is the boss now?" Da, 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 da. He got mm -hmm. mad and walked off, and stormed off. Something is not adding up, and they know that something's going on. They know. And Drew said it. 
And Diana's going to be able to figure it out. We've already seen her ability to figure things out and manipulate. And she's lost her virginity, so I, I assume that she's going to become even more manipulative because her innocence has been taken. <laughs> <laughs> her innocence is gone, so she's even more manipulative. Um, She's going to figure that out, though, or Very somebody soon. is. And Lorenzo's going to die. Without any question, Lorenzo's dead. Um, Who else is dead? Let's call some more deaths aside. Mm, that um the dude that did the with uh Tariq, but it was supposed to be Brayden that killed him. He was threatening Brayden and the, Ru- the Russian connect. Yeah, he was threatening Brayden and uh Tariq for some money, and Ooh. Tariq was like the the white the white dude. Huh? He was young. It was a young dude. He was in a hotel room or wherever he was at, and then Tariq was like, "Your dad left you." Some money or some y'all don't remember that? No. Nah. The one that did the he was in it with the cold thing. In the last the very last season oh, the very last oh, episode oh, from last oh, season. Oh, oh, I know he said no 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 listen. It's um what's the when when Ghost was beef with the nigga over the clubs? What's that white the, the pedophile ass nigga? Oh, oh, oh Simon Stern. Simon Stern's his little gay his, little, his little boy toy that they broke up with. He killed him. Yeah, remember Tariq stabbed him. Oh, oh yeah, he did. He Brayden was Brayden was supposed to kill him, but Brayden is so <laughs> pussy. How are you supposed to be Tommy and you don't kill Hassan? Wait, Brayden supposed to be Tommy? I mean, think about it. He's the white guy. Hassan, how many bodies does Tommy have? Too many. Too many. Probably over thirty. He has over thirty. We because we were looking at the body count of all the cast members. Tommy has the most kills. This nigga can't get one kill. He ain't got no one. Can't, that's why I can't keep saying you owe me a body. He do. You said what aside? Brayden hasn't killed a single person. You know, he also knows that he didn't kill Lauren. Yeah. Well, I mean, he he technically thinks that Lauren is dead, and he he thinks Effie did it. Effie did it exactly. But Kane knows that it wasn't Brayden because I I believe he sent Effie to go help. Yes, he sent Effie because he knew Brayden couldn't do it. And then now now I want to ask you this: What do you think the likelihood of Kane and Effie fucking is? Oh no, they're going to fuck. They're going to fuck. It. <laughs> Jesus Christ! I can see That's it. Exactly, every time, I'm like, oh, they're. I going, can see They it. are Kane, going to have Kane, say. He's too determined. Kane is already fantasizing in everything. That's why. Uh, what's his name? Tariq was like, keep my girl name out your mouth. He can already see it. He probably knows it's already happening in their heads. He you just know, does no, not want to believe no, it. You're ex- she's exactly right. It's, this it's already happening. <laughs> Somehow Tariq is going to get close to Lauren, and she's going to see that and hate, and then go fuck on Kane. And Tariq's going to Cl- kill Not Lauren, Close Diana. to Lauren, you Diana. mean Diana? Diana. No, I mean Lauren. Lauren is not Lauren in the picture in- right now. When she comes back in the picture, this whole shit is going to be different. That's gonna, Everybody's going back to where they came from. Somehow, some way, Effie's going to get jealous. She's going to fuck Kane. Diana. Tariq. It, you, hold on, but you know that, that, that scene was cold, though. When Braid is gonna get his first kill in Effie. Braid is killing Effie. You heard it here first. <laughs> I don't see it, but okay. I think Effie is going to be a mainstay character throughout the duration of this show. I think I think I think he might be right because if Brayden kills Effie before Effie can open her mouth to say I was helping Brayden kill Lauren. I perfect don't see sense. It. I don't I don't Brayden better get it together. I, I don't see it. What I what I can see is though I would kill him. Um Let me kill her. what I can see is I well no no. This was the cold scene though that 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 Effie and Diana scene in the stairs. Mm-hmm. That was a crazy scene because it was it, it was kind of weird. Basically, Effie said, "I did sabotage your relationship, but it's because you didn't you know you you shouldn't fuck with Tariq." How do you how, should Diana have just taken it that easy? No, you think she should have just took off on the bitch? Yeah, stairs? yeah, that's what you would have did. What about you, Aside? How do you feel about that? She's grimy. Effie. You said Effie what? Effie's scared, bro. Effie, why do you mean Effie's scared? What Effie got to be scared you, of? Because she's jealous already. She knows. She, she really has, hated on that bitch. She's jealous. Yeah, she had to hate, bro. Because You don't. Have she already. She even said it. Like you could tell she's jealous because when Tariq and um, Diana was doing the the thing for Zeke. Mm-hmm. They were planning to all. I guess what they were taking too long when when Tariq came back and she was like, "What? Where you been?" or whatever, yeah. something like that. And he was like, "I've been planning." Da, 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 da. And she said something smart. I don't remember what she said, but mm-hmm. you can tell she's jealous. Like, 
And she want, and she's probably gonna fuck on Kane for that, just for that. She's gonna fuck on Kane for sure. That that Regardless, that is going to happen. That's gonna be her she's, little excuse. She's when she not, wants to fuck Kane. She's not putting up enough of a fight. You can tell. She wants a nigga like Kane. Yeah. She wants a crazy. She thinks Tariq is not like. You know, he's like calm, crazy, but uh, Kane is insane. Yeah, she wants Kane, man. That's gonna. They are going to be together. So she, so with Effie off the table, it's back between Diana and Lauren when she come back on the scene. And that bitch ass nigga is gonna pick Lauren. That's the cold part. Always. I never liked her. I never liked her either. Ever since she told on that nigga, Every- that choke has been fuck her. Remember, Dude, she told she got him kicked out of choke. Well, who? You know, she, so she got she she got him kicked out of choke for when he was selling drugs when he was in high school. She told on Tariq. Yeah. <laughs> she told on Tariq. I just didn't like her when she told that girl. Something about leave Tariq alone. After that scene, that was it for me. I was like, no. Just a hating ass bitch. Just hating. I couldn't believe that shit. But that shit is real. Bitches hate like that, huh? Be they tell you don't don't be with him next to next thing you know they with, with him. Yeah, like, like bitch, get out the way. Rook. I need <laughs> you out the way. I need her out of the way. <laughs> That's crazy, man. That's brutal. Girls are diabolical. What else do we got from power? There's something else we're not talking about. Um, this Hassan Blanca. I hate her so much. She's a. You know what she reminds me? You never watched Law and Order Criminal Intent? No. She reminds me of this white dude on there. That the other uh, police officer? Yeah, just a, so just annoying. Fuck out. <laughs> she did get knocked. Who up. is she? I don't remember her. She, she was a cop. She was NYPD in the last season, working with the dirty cop. When Tariq killed the nigga who killed Raina. That's when she came onto the scene. And then she was there when Go- the night Ghost got killed. She was there the night Ghost got killed. And it, uh, a Ghost allegedly was killed. He's, he's not killed. Right? We know that for sure. But I don't I don't so know. So you, th- you still think Ghost is dead? I don't think Ghost is dead, but I think because... Because if th- Lauren is alive, they can bring Ghost back. No, easy. easily. But my thing is because 50 ended his partnership with Stars, I think he they might pull the plug on bringing Ghost back. 50 ended his partnership? Yeah, Stars didn't want to give him enough money. So he ended, so they got all the power shows, but all his, the rest of his shows, he's taking somewhere else. Him and Lala was supposed to have a show. It's a multiple show supposed to be at Stars. He's taking them other places. So the Tommy is still going to be on Stars and yeah. stuff like that? All the, all the shows BMF? that are on there, they're going to stay on there. And then they're not doing Tate show. That's why Tate is going to be more incorporated into this show because Tate's not going to get his own show. And then all his other shows outside of Power and BMF, he's taking somewhere else. So he just, I think he just did something with FX. He's probably going to take Snoop Dogg's show to FX. Murder was the case. He's got a, He's got like 20 shows in development right now, though. A gang of shit. I was looking at all of them like two nights ago. Crazy. That's probably why he's doing a rotation because they don't know what to do. Mm-hmm. That's the thing that with the original power, there was okay, there was multiple obstacles, but it's, but at least it felt like okay, well, once this, once he just gets the club from Simon Stern, everything's gonna go back to normal. Or once what, 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 what after they get this uh, conjured bitch out of there, then what? You got We still gotta see how he's gonna get back with his mom and, and sister. That's what we're yeah, waiting on. Yeah, no, that that is what's dangling. Is, That's what we're waiting is on. A That's really reunion. what I've been waiting on. I'm waiting on him to see his mom and sister. That's what. That's the thing. They're in a hideout or something. Like I don't know. Is somebody trying to kill his mom or something? Tommy. Oh. Tommy's alive. Dang, I forgot. <laughs> that Tommy shit is crazy. I mean, I don't know. I c- what could happen is Tariq can snitch on somebody. And go to witness protection and get put with his mom. That was the most sorriest thing I would ever. If they do that, he can he can snitch on no money. If <laughs> if he do that, <laughs> I will. This show is that I will never watch this show ever again. <laughs> <laughs> no, because can't go out like that. No, <laughs> I would definitely tell stars, fuck off, fuck off. 50 could sabotage the show just to say fuck stars. Yeah. I feel like he might. He might. It won't be as 50 cent. He can do anything. 
That man can really do anything. He still got other business. He don't give a damn. Yeah, but that's the first one. I mean, listen, you have to understand. You're saying that, but we're talking about somebody who is the pettiest asshole Very. arguably ever. So he'll do some shit like that. He doesn't care. I want to come to his bread. I think he'd care. But it doesn't matter. He's not making any more bread with them. That's the point. What do he say? If I'm getting money, I can't get nothing with you, then fuck you. Hassan, people are people are not going to be <laughs> reluctant. He's going to go on Twitter and say, "You fucking right, I sabotage that show." Stars ain't want to cut the check. Fuck them; they don't get to eat. Well, I don't know. Is he liable to get sued if he says that? If he, if he acknowledges, tr that he tr 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 trust me, he's not scared of lawsuits. He's not. He files bankruptcy and hides his money in corporations. That's why they say his net worth is twenty million. My ass. We're talking about somebody who may who is probably approaching a billion. Who made two hundred million? Off, off one single deal, then came and hit him with hit Lionsgate, hit stars for twenty million before he get did power. The headphones that nigga had, the headphones that had the Disney deal. Come on, the Diamond Mine. No, he got a liquor. Yeah, he had he had effing, and now he's got Branson, and he's got the champagne. And his champagne and his and his Branson got to deal with like two, three NBA teams. That nigga's having money. So he ain't worried. And he just sold all them records. Come on now. But uh, I don't know. It, it's something else though. But Monet. Monet's giving me. I know I know she just lost her, her son, mm -hmm. but she need to get back on the what? outside. She so needs to get back think outside. About, think about something different. Get her head in the game. She look crazy. Monet looks crazy. Monet does not even look like Monet. She Monet looks like the real Mary J. Blige. Yeah, Monet, you know you're right. She's not looking like Monet. Monet <laughs> is a whole character that, that Mary J. Blige is not. And and what's cold also is the fact that it seems like she's detached from her whole family now. It, Very. It, she don't seem like mom no more to them. It seems like we see Monet and then the rest of the family on two different storylines. Seems like Monet is closer with Tariq right now than she is with the rest of the family. She's closer to outside than she is to her family. I know in her bones she feel like something is not right. Yeah, even though she killed that nigga, it's, it's not enough. Yeah, she's something just like something is not right, and she about to find out. And now when she finds out, Lorenzo is dead. No, Lorenzo's a dead man. Without any question, Lorenzo's dead. Um, I don't know who's going to jail. Lorenzo's dead, and probably can't. She's probably gonna. She probably gonna get mad at Kane. She might go to jail though too. Kane is not even Kane. Kane is her son, right? Mm -hmm, yes. And he's not telling her. That's You're true. using this over just to gain power. That's that's. I think that's f that like that's fucked up. No, the more people who know, by the time it comes out, she's gonna probably say fuck all of them because that's even her whole demeanor, the way she operate. She's liable to say fuck everybody if she finds out that all of y'all knew that that Lorenzo killed Zeke and didn't say anything for any reason. She's going to say, fuck you. And then what? It's going to be fuck everybody. But she might go her ass to jail. Though. Bullets, bullets. She's about to. Somebody's going to die. Somebody Somebody's dying. Die. And somebody may go to jail. She's probably going to take Kane away. <laughs> and the, Somebody has to take somebody. <laughs> blood for blood. <laughs> you shot my son, I'm going to shoot my son and your son. Fuck so. it. This is your son. This is Lorenzo Jr. We killing him. Fuck it. Kill the gay nigga, man. Kill Drew. I was just about to <laughs> Are you sick of Drew Asad? I'm sick of that fuck nigga, bro. He's literally a fuck nigga, bro. <laughs> He's supposed to be taking over the company. How the fuck he gonna take over the company? He's in his emotions. You know, Kane and Effie, that's who's gonna be running this company. Kane and Effie. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. BMF is, uh, BMF is better than this shit. I don't watch that bullshit. Yeah, I tried to watch. I tried to get. I can't get jiggy with this. You shit. can't get jiggy with BMF, right? Mm -hmm. I just can't get jiggy with that shit. It's too slow. It's I don't know. I can't do it. I can't do it. What I'm watching though, religiously outside of power, is um, Baddies West. No, no, I haven't watched that yet. <laughs> I'm watching. Um, it's great. I'm on Hulu. I'm watching. It's, this is probably an old show. It's called Rookie. Oh, with my baby in it, Niecy Nash. Mm. No, it's the white guy, or is it the black girl, black lady? It's white about, guy. Okay, not yet. I'm thinking the, about rookie feds or something like that. That's no, Nash well, it, 
It's a police show. Yeah. It's all like an old white guy, but he's like this first yeah. year of a cop. Yeah. I ain't watching that boy. It's actually funny. I ain't watching that boy. It's probably funny, though. <laughs> uh, uh, I don't it know. Black, it's black people in it. I'm sure. I uh, Hassan been trying to get me to start Young Rock. Right, Hassan? What is that? A show about the rock. The 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 fighter. The wrestler, huh? <laughs> what you laughing about? What's Nothing. funny? I'm saying what 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 is his show about? And when he was he's young. just com- a comedian. That's why I'm like, I yeah, never take him serious. Honestly, it's, there's nothing wrong with the show. Like, it's, it's, I've never seen a show where there's just like it's perfect. Like, there's just nothing wrong. I don't get mad at it. It's just perfect. A perfect show. So is it like what a reality show or? No, nah, it's like a show. About him growing is up? Is it, yeah, like, d- growing up as a... So in, basically, in, like, Chris Rock? The, the premise of the show, yeah, uh, at least kinda. one, is The Rock is, it's like, it takes place like 20, 28, or some shit like that. The Rock is running for president, and then he just gives flashbacks about how some shit reminds him of this memory in his childhood, and he just goes through different stages in his... The 80s, and, the early 90s. Yeah, it's, it's amazing. Like I said, it's perfect. And I don't understand why you're not watching it. It's kind of... No, I'm going to watch it. I'm not not yeah. watching it. Is is there something going on with Trump? Yeah. Trump went to jail today. Yeah, what... They, Free Trump. They said the dude... They didn't even say the... I think my sister was showing me a, a, something they said on Instagram. He's back in Florida. You know what it is. We make bail, nigga. Go ahead. <laughs> they had said something about the, the dude that was on Home Alone instead of calling him president. Macaulay Culkin. Why did they say somebody that I was that was on Home Alone? Like they referred to him as an actor instead of our old president. They were like one of our favorite actors. Yeah, is going to jail. That's weird. He's the, he was the president. Once you're a president, but he was also a, in Home Alone. Did you know that? I didn't know that. I think so. I think because part of Home Alone was at his building, Trump Tower. Oh, but who gives a damn? He's the president. Once you're a president, that's what you're I'm supposed saying, to just be saying, called the president. <laughs> Everybody else is called the president forever after you were the president, Mister President. I mean, he wasn't horrible, but I think he was a great. I think he gave he gave all that money. He certainly helped you out a lot. Yeah, I mean, you know, <laughs> I mean, I didn't get none of it. The PPP, you know. Well, but you did. I didn't. And the the, the niggas who had what, it, the one the one the one check that I got. But the niggas who had it, they came in and they spent money. Okay. So you know you fair, got it that fair way. Game, fair game. Fair game. <laughs> you know. So uh, you we all profited from Trump. Fair game. Lower gas prices. Right, because now it's high, and he he brought Kodak Black out of jail. He brought Lil Wayne out of jail. He freed them niggas. Wow, pardon, presidential pardons, federal jail. So you know you we think should, you did that for Young Thug. Yes, well, but you can't because he's in Georgia. He's not in federal. Oh, he can oh, only okay, do it okay. for federal prisoners. But he would have freed Thug, you saw, and they and they let Thug go to his um sister's funeral. They usually let people go to funerals even if you like For them. Real? Even if you're in prison, yeah. Depending on how close they were, like your mom or something like that, they go, they'll let you go to the funeral. You're going to have to have an escort and shit like that. You know, he, you don't just like really get to go out. You know what I mean? You get an escort. But, yeah, you know. I mean, because yeah. if I really get to go out, <laughs> I'm Nigga, I'm outside. gone. I'm gone. <laughs> What's the next move? I'm gone. Yeah. Uh, anything else about Power Hazard? Um, it's, it's, uh, it's really disappointing me right now. I don't think it's trash right now. I think it's I think it's mid though. I think it's mid. It they're, was they're coming back. Episode you know. one felt trash. Two and three, it's mid. It's power, so I'm gonna stick with it regardless. I'm waiting on Lauren. hmm There's some stuff. Lauren's gonna be a huge curveball in this whole thing. Without any question. Um I'm not- I'm not ready to give up on it, but I just can't wait till we get to have a conversation about Young Rock. That's man. That's uh, let me show see. You I'll go, I'll just go watch. <laughs> you go watch it. What you is go it? Watch. Why is it Young? Or young like Rock. Young, young Thug. Like no, Young. The young Young. Like y- regular Young. Like a regular. And young. then regular Rock. Where is it on? It's on Peacock. Is it on Hulu? Hassan? Uh, it probably is. Yeah, I watch it on a. Uh, oh, watch it. I, I watch it on a. On a Legal website. Yeah, it's legal. It's legal. Are you, are you sure that the website that you are looking at is on is legal? Well, it, I don't think it's illegal. I mean, it's a website. How can it be illegal, right? A dot com. <laughs> a dot com would have to be legal. Is it a D O T or is it a dot? Dot 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 com. <laughs> Power.
we're now on episodes four and five since last time. Are you caught up? I'm caught up. Everybody's caught up. I'm caught up. I'm caught up. Lorenzo Tejada, we knew he was gonna die. Yeah. We did. I didn't think it was gonna be so. Oh fast. my god, I forgot about that. I knew he was gonna die. Yeah. He's done. He's done. But he's dead. They slick cut though. It's over. Mm -hmm. I, I didn't know. You, you don't think that he, he can come back from that? What? No, not the way they showed. They showed him. Die. Yeah, like he fucking was gasping for air. From a homosexual. From I didn't know <laughs> that he killed his. Father. The nigga that's did fucking his that? son. Who killed? Yeah, he did kill his father. The nigga that's fucking well, no, no, no. his son. He didn't kill his father. Um. The, the he kid, put out a hit. He did put out the hit, though. He put out the hit. Yeah, okay. But okay. his father was a fucking rat. Yeah, okay. Right? Something like that. I don't remember his father. That's what I'm trying to I say. I don't believe him. It was last season or the season before. Or okay, something. okay. So what do you guys think about Lauren being back? Oh, 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 oh. Let me, let me drop a bomb. Hold on. So, remember, Tariq has the dream. Everybody in the room is dead. Remember? Yeah. Uh -huh. Who wasn't in the room? Lauren. She was outside the room. And then Ghost called. And remember, we... And remember, we talked yeah, about it then. Like, fucking way back then. Yes. We talk, we been talked about it, but Lauren threw us off, though, because... She wasn't in there. But she wasn't in the actual room with all the dead people, so that proves... That she was Ghost alive. Was, that proves that she was alive, but also that proves that Ghost, Ghost is alive. Because alive she was alive, That proves Ghost is alive. And... They have to bring Ghost. They will bring Ghost. You, do you know what? What if Ghost is who's behind the, Everything. the fucking African girl from uh, England? What Wouldn't if he's... That be some shit? And he's looking like, yeah, this is, you know. And, <laughs> and they like, can't hurt... Like that they know that they girl, can't hurt the that son. African girl's literally just making Tariq under her, under her thumb. She really won't kill him. She knows she can't kill she's him. she's making him do shit for him, though. But really, this Ghost really doing shit. Now... Exactly. You see what I'm saying? And <sighs> she's protect he's protecting him this whole time. This whole time. It's possible, bro. It's fucking bad. That's possible, possible, bro. That's possible, bro. I want Ghost to come so back. So what he I want Ghost to come back desperately. He had to get Lorenzo out of there. Who? Ghost. No, no Ghost. That wasn't that was Ghost Monet's ain't, decision. He ain't, got to, he ain't got nothing to do with uh, That Ghost. was Monet's decision. Monet killed that man. Monet no, went no. and was talking shit. I think Lorenzo didn't have to die, but I knew he was going to because yeah. somebody's got to die is power, and he's the most expendable person. And the way Monet was talking, you could tell she did not give a fuck. She went and told that lady. She's she she's said, fine. whatever you do, I'm not going to say anything, but why are you saying that and you're not telling her that Lorenzo killed Zeke. You didn't say. You didn't say that. Yeah. You left that part out. Yeah. Of course. You're doing that because you're trying to set him up. Yeah. She did that to her own husband, and now, granted, he confessed, and that was the ill part too. That he literally just confessed, and granted, I can see that you wouldn't be forgiving, mm -hmm. but she to still go went and told to that dude killed. Yeah. That's crazy. Right. Because even I bet I bet you the mom did not tell that boy that um that she came to her. That Frank, yeah, whatever, whoever killed so and so killed his dad. Mm -hmm. I bet you Monet went and talked to that boy. It was Monet that did it. And then the the crazy thing about it is Lorenzo it's, had ooh. a great point when he said, "Monet, you brought him in this shit. That's right. He was fine. You pretended like he wasn't your kid. You had him grow up down. You should have just left him where the fuck he was. You shouldn't have brought him in the house where the fucking dope operation is being ran. You jeopardized the life of your son. Truthfully, mm -hmm. so yes, I did kill your son." It was a total action. I thought I was killing the, the nigga you was about to run off with me on, your fucking baby's father, mm -hmm. right? But it's not like this isn't partially your fault. If you wouldn't have killed his fucking girlfriend, he wouldn't have felt like potentially snitching on you or going to run off. Right. Like, it, it, Monet, she, it's, it's her own yeah, fault. She had it planned out, though. When she killed that man, she had, Lorenzo, like, she had it planned out. She told Lorenzo, I want a divorce. Lorenzo left, and she told him not to come back. Mm-hmm. The kids are waiting on him to come back. The she natural goes, place for him to be is at the bar yeah. that they own. Yeah, but she goes, um, when the kids ask for him, she goes, uh, um, I don't know. I don't know where he's at. He's coming back. Basically. She said, but when he does come back, we need to talk to you guys about something. Yeah. Knowing Genius. that he's not coming back. But I'm, yeah. I'm going to tell you who she's going to tell Kane. about that. No, she's going to tell Tariq. Because she's closer to Tariq now than anybody. She's having but, the but secret Kane, meetings with Tariq. Kane is going to know that when they killed him. Killed, 
Zeke. Kane is going to know because Kane already knew that Lorenzo killed Zeke. Then he died in front of Zeke. He for, he died in front of Zeke's um uh rig- mural. Yeah. Mural. Now here's the thing. Last time when you weren't here, we talked about um the time the the shot clock for when Kane is going to have sex with Effie. That's yeah, going to happen. That's about to be. That's going to happen. Away. You think that's going to happen? Oh, it's going to happen. They're, so, they're fucking sexual. Lauren retention. is already back in the episode. I'm so. so glad Effie fucking told the truth. No, she Wait. didn't. Mm-mm. No, she did. She mentioned it. Tell the truth to who? She she said, I have something to tell you. No, no, she didn't. She, she never said, told I him. love you. Uh, she never okay. told him. She said, I love you. And and he he literally just looked like, like, yo, this is her moment. I don't he want didn't say nothing. He didn't say nothing bad when she yeah, said that. Nah, listen. So he, he, no, he's about to make a move on Effie. This whole thing, because he's an emotional bitch like his father over his fucking punk ass bitch. He is going to do something stupid. Do something stupid, and it's gonna divide everything. Monet just killed Lorenzo. It looks like he's gonna try to kill her. He might kill. He might not. Effie. He might kill Effie. He, I don't know what Effie. Is no, Effie is gonna run. Leave. She's gonna, have to go she gonna get with Kane. She's gonna have to no, go no, hide. she's gonna get with Kane, and he's definitely gonna kill her. And, 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 and he, she's gonna get with Kane, and it's gonna be a war. And then if she gets with Kane, you gotta go get Kane's sister, nigga. If you's a real nigga, who's Monet riding with? Her son. Monet don't give a fuck about nobody right now. Listen, who's I'll be Monet honest ride? with you. She ride with Tariq. She might. Have to ride. I with won't Tariq. say for sure, but she might. But the thing is, she don't like Diana. She don't like her daughter. I was about to say that. That's why I say she, I think she's on her own team right now. No, she is. She does not trust Kane. Kane did not tell her. She feels like Kane knew about Zeke's death, and she, Kane did not tell her. She just feels like everybody's not on her side. He tried to save his father too. Kate, no, he tried to save his own ass. Everybody's for themselves right now. He tried to control his. He tried to control his dad. His dad tried to save him. That's when he looked out for his dad. That, that's that's not what made fair. him soften up about his father. That's not yeah. fair. When his father pushed him out the way when, when the crackers were shooting. You telling yeah. me your dad died? That's when you would have looked at him like and be like, that's "Oh." That's why I said he tried to save his father from you know. He tried to later. Save after he the tried bag. to extort. He tried to play his father. He did. I mean, he tried to play. He tried <laughs> like, who does that though? You extort I want to your dad. My dad. I mean, you better. I would him. rather just go tell my mom what's up and I let mean, her handle it. To I'd have told pop. Time, I'd have told though. pop pops. I'm ready to take this to. Yeah, the but that's why he's not ready to be in the fort. Whatever. He's not ready to be a leader because he don't even know how to lead. He's not a leader. He's that's not what a leader does. He's way too much of a high head to be a leader. I'm being honest with you. I'm mad at Fifty because Fifty keeps on showing these. With the gay scenes, bro, we have to blame Courtney Kemp for that. The showrunner. I'm just saying, when is Light Skin Keisha gonna? I get keep. A scene? I just fast forward. So, the girl in the class. What? What you? What you? When is she gonna get a scene? I think Tate is gonna fuck her. That's what I think. I think Tate is scandalous, and he's gonna fuck the intern. Hold on. Would you fuck the intern? Let's Light Skin Keisha. If like, if Light Skin. There's a legitimate narrative that I don't like licensing girls. That's a narrative. I didn't say that you don't like them, but I, I can show a laundry list of licensing girls I fuck with. A laundry list. Wait, that you? Okay. I can. I can. not Yeah, I don't believe I that. I got one. I could go back in the archives, nigga. Since I know you. Before and since. Why well, gotta be since I know you? Though I've I've lived a life. I've lived the whole life. Since I know you. Since I know you. First off, you know you know at least a two. What are you talking about? One. One. You know at least two. I know at least two. Hold on. Oh, okay. She knows at least two. Okay, two. Okay, two. Boom. At least two. Two, two, two. So that's weird. It's a weird narrative that's existing about me. Okay. But whatever. And I've been confronted about it. Yeah. But whatever. Um, what do you think about the person now that found out about uh what's the white boy name? Therese Boy. The one of the works of the firm, Braden. What's the Braden, name? The girl who also works there. They, 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 he just fucked. Yeah, he just fucked. Just check it for him. Want to fuck him in Italy? Remember, she found out. She saw his phone. The cash coins. I didn't see that. She picked up his phone when he dropped he, it. He dropped it the time, and he saw. She saw the the money flowing through, which was the money from the drugs. That, but I don't know. If she knows what it's for. She don't. She don't know what's up. But, but she knows something is that's up. That's the reason why she came to Therese's door. She'll be dead. She's done. If she tried, if she tries to, if she tries to play, they're gonna kill her. Listen, that right there, she's gonna die. Let's do. We know this is power. We know how power works. 
She's now been marked for if death. She's not in. If she's not in to play, she and she just wants to run her mouth. She's gonna. Okay. Yeah. So the wealthy dude, what's his name? The wealthy Jake. Lucas. Uh, the nigga from the Wire. It was funny is he's in the Wire and Power, so he's goaded. He's Nigerian. Yeah, yeah he looks yeah, Nigerian. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He, I'm anxious to see what he does with Tariq. He likes Tariq. He likes Tariq a lot. Tariq, he, you know what he's probably going to do is say, Tariq, fuck that firm and fuck that internship. I mean, Come right. and work for me. I got a great position for you. But Tariq's going to find another way to try to spin it and try to get to where he wants. I mean, you can get out of school. What if Ghost is working with him? The Nigerian dude. What if he had this his boy associate? The thing is, with, with, with this potential of Ghost coming back, he could be <laughs> anywhere and he could be connected to he anyone. Say, what did he say when he met when he talked to Tariq? He said, I know about father. your dad. I know about your father. I mean, who didn't know about his dad? He's I'm just saying. In New York. Nah, but, but nobody knew him as Ghost. Nobody knew who he was. They just knew the name. But he went on the stand, though. Remember, he got, he got, he got indicted. No, no. For, but people indicted. still but don't know Tommy exactly. Tommy was accused of being Ghost. Not He was never... James St. Patrick has never been accused of being ghost publicly. Mm -hmm. See what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So people don't know that. People know he was a businessman. People know he was going to be lieutenant governor of the state of New York. True. Mm. People know that he was murdered in the nightclub. Mm -hmm. They don't know by who. Wait, they do they think Tariq did it? Tariq killed his father. No, they they, they, they think they, they think Tasha did it though. No, no, they, they think, think one of them did it. did it. They think Tariq, did it. but they really think Tariq did it. Remember, because that's still playing. They said you killed your school. father. They killed your father. Yeah, that's what they were saying. The rumors in in class. Yeah, and he's trying he said to Tariq. He's trying to get away from that. What you Tariq. did it <laughs> right, but he's not dead. Ghosts never die. Don't you know that? They need to bring Tommy's. Force shit back. They're going to. It's next. Oh, okay. Force is next. You still haven't seen any of it, right? I saw that first episode, man. That's it, bro. Guys. Have you seen Force? Yeah, I saw the first episode. Let's do. Oh man, I like no, it. I'm gonna try to watch it. I liked it. I liked it. I'm not Tommy, fucking. Tommy's with wrecking it. some shit in Chicago. I bet he is. It's a good show. A lot of you know he's in. He's in. That it man is a show. woman beater. Who him? Tommy? Oh my god! What? When we talk about the merger, yeah. WWE UFC merger, they're about to make WWE's about to make fifty million in cuts. Fifty million—that's a lot of jobs. Yo, sidebar real quick. Yo, do you understand what's going on out here, Cat? Intercession? Huh? Wait, what's going on with the world right now? What's Economically, like money wise, just no, nothing. Like no, I just th- I do didn't you- know a recession was about to happen. We know we already are in the recession. <clears throat> okay, what's happening next? Well, I mean, what, what would you say, Chief? Definitely, uh, the digital uh, reform. What is it called? The the, the, the um central bank digitalized currency. CBDC. Yeah, I mean that's definitely going to be uh, Chain, taking time. dollars and going digital, which means what you can't you can't evade taxes, you can't make money on the table. Nothing. They're going to be in full control and be able to monitor every single penny that you make. And when does that go in effect? I mean, they're 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 starting to roll it out in July. Uh-huh. It's I mean, it's, it's been happening, right? It's 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 their priority since last year, of, right? A movement, but 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 essentially, what they want to be able to do is monitor and control everything you're spending. Yeah, this is why, they, like, this is why they're letting these niggas do all the scamming and shit, because shit like this is what they're going to be able to go and tell people and go, this is why we have to change. Because look what you can do when when it's just like this. We have to change. Yeah. It's going to be all of this shit is just the justification yeah, for absolutely. the bullshit. Every, before they do some bullshit, they have to do, yeah. do something ahead of time to justify the bullshit. Mm-hmm. You know, mm-hmm. Before, if they want to take your guns, they have to do a bunch of, oh, people are shooting everything up. So guess what? It's not safe. We got to take guns. Mm-hmm. You know, that's just. That's harder to do, number one, because it's ingrained into the Constitution, the Second Amendment, the second thing that you have the right to in the Constitution, number one. And then number two, it's kind of a bad argument because it's like, okay, but if people are getting guns and shooting people, shouldn't I have a gun? So if that happens to me, I can protect myself. That's problematic. Right? Like when people said when Walmart, after there was a shooting in Walmart in El Paso, they were like, oh, Walmart's going to ban guns from Walmart. But that only lets me know that if I want to kill people, I can go to Walmart because nobody has a gun there. Mm-hmm. Stupid rule. Yeah, you see what I'm saying. Yeah. What about sex? Sex? Kill him, please. He, he, he's supposed to die so long ago, Whoa. and somehow he's just been surviving. 
I feel like him and a lawyer now forgot his name. Let's just say Method Man. They're gonna fucking do some wonderful things. Thank God. I don't. I don't think so. I mean, the bitch broke up. Nah, but he's a bitch ass pussy ass. He man. might come back. So he's gonna know, go back. Definitely. She's gonna go like this, and he's gonna fucking. He's so pussy. Yeah, with. he is. Now that he, now that she lost Lauren, he might. But like, what the fuck? Because it seems like she is. He's convincing Lauren to testify still. In the yeah. preview, if you saw that preview. Why does he want to get fucking Tariq so bad again? Because he's had a hard on for Tariq and Tariq's father. That's what it was. For so long. You know? Mm -hmm. For so long. Mm -hmm. So, in understanding that, I think that... I think he's just... These cops, they get obsessed. Mm -hmm. He's obsessed. Mm -hmm. And he just is convinced... I, I don't know. We just got to see what's going to happen. I Here's what I don't want. I do not want to see Tariq go back to jail. No. I don't think he will. But Ghost went twice. Okay. So maybe he will. Okay. It's when in, in power when the main character is in jail, that shit is so nerve wracking to watch. Because it's like when you're in jail, bro, you can't do shit. Yeah. It's you are exciting. totally reliant. Yeah. upon everybody else yeah. to get everything done, done. that needs yeah. to be done yeah. and yeah. and when you're like how ghost and his son are you want to do everything you don't even want to let anybody do anything else mm -hmm. so you feel we feel how nerve-wracking it is for those individuals during that time mm -hmm. i don't want to see him go back to jail i just i feel like that nigerian chick gonna keep him out of trouble a lot do we again? Do we feel like Ghost is a part of this? Because I would say so. because again, I would say he's so. talking about Mecca, and that was Mecca's uh, fiance. What? And, the, what if that's a bullshit backstory? Oh, hold on, but you know, remember the last thing that uh, that Effie said? What about her daughter? You get her daughter, then you got her Achilles heel. Yeah, and her daughter. Is with the Italian dude. She just knocked her baby father over. That's a big deal. That's a big deal. So he's trying to get from underneath that thumb, get to her daughter, just so he can have some type of control, which I don't know. He got his ass saved that day. I'll tell you that. He sure did because it was going to happen to him. It was going to happen ass. to that nigga. You know what I'm saying? Ghost might be behind that shit, though. Not behind that, but I'm saying behind Where is Ghost? He okay. We we've we've always believed he's alive. We now have more proof that he's alive. Yeah. But where is he? If we saw Lauren die, which we did, we saw Ghost die the same way we saw Lauren die, right? Yeah. Okay. Similar way, right? Mm -hmm. So if he's not dead, where is Ghost? What is he doing? I don't know. I don't know. It's hard to say. Yeah, he's man. with Tommy or somewhere. somewhere. He's not with Tommy, though, because we know what's going on with Tommy. Hey, Tommy's in Chicago. He ran off. On his way to California. On his way to California. Where is Ghost? To go meet Ghost or just play? Maybe. <laughs> Why is Tommy going to California? I don't think Ghost is in the country, though. It would make sense for him to be out of the country. I don't know. I what don't know. if? What? Ghost is with the mom and kid. No. Where are they? They're, in protection. they're hidden. They're, they're in Witsec. Yeah, okay, 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 okay. They're with who? Witsec, witness protection. Yeah. But what, who, what side of the police? Remember the, the, the feds. The feds, I think. FBI. But not with like sex and them, right? No, no. Well, sex used to be fed. But mm -hmm. Of course, he's just private sector and fucking the cop, the regular cop. And she's just yeah. a DA and then they got yeah. DA. Um, what about that phone? They got that phone. They had to go up in there and get that phone off the informant. We were wondering why he was taking pictures. Remember when he seen Lorenzo on him? Yeah, that dropped, would have been that would have been so bad. Yeah, yeah. That would have been so bad if yeah. that phone would have been recovered. Yeah, yeah. That would have been horrible. Oh, yeah. Yeah. They got that phone just in the nick of time. It's a lot going on. Mm -hmm. Again, I didn't like the first episode that much. But they've certainly redeemed themselves, mm -hmm. as they always do. Let's be honest with you. They're, that's why it's like, I didn't like the first episode, but it's power. So it doesn't really matter. <laughs>
what's going on. It's typically, so the first episode, I mean, obviously the first episode is always like a deal breaker sometimes, but you know. I, I, I have too much. This show has too much credit with me. So you're going to watch it. So it's got enough credit to where, you know, we're going to prove a million dollar law. <laughs> we're approving whatever you, whatever you guys want, we're going to approve. Okay. okay. As far as this show, not, it doesn't include force. Maybe it should, but I just couldn't get into force. You, you haven't seen Snowfall, right? I've seen Snow in the first season. I watched a few episodes, but I haven't followed. Uh, he, like, I mean, I mean, uh, uh, a power Reddit, and they put a lot of Snowfall shit in there too, and I'm, yeah. I don't know. I'm lost. Yes, yeah, Snowfall. He he he's definitely he's losing it right now. He's losing it. Well, it's about time for. I'm hearing that that Michael Rainey, which plays Tariq, only wants to do one more season. He wants next season to be the last. Tariq, season. Uh-huh. how much is he getting paid? Probably good, but he he's been on. He's like I've been playing Tariq for ten years. Has it been? I want to do something else. Yeah, but do what? What do you want to do? Get more roles. Thing, yeah. He wants to become Michael B. Jordan. Exactly. exactly, exactly. <laughs> you want the Michael B. Jordan role. Exactly. Yeah. But Michael B. Jordan had to disappear for like 15 years in order to be who he is. Because that nigga was gone. Because remember, he was in the movies when he was a young nigga. Um, Hardball. He was in The Wire. Mm-hmm. Then he just vanished. And then he just pops back up. And I he's... just think he wants to grow up. Yeah. He probably hasn't yeah, lived his life yet. Be, yeah, he doesn't want to be classified in that same role all the time. I feel it, but you're, 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 you're. You're, you're making money, like you're a part of a cultural phenomenon. That's how we feel as fans, and that's how you got out. That's how that's how he was. Yeah, what that's you, how we met him. Like, what what else you want? What else you want to do? I mean, you bro, we're, you're gonna go do other stuff. I feel like he needs to do two more seasons. Okay, at least two until, more seasons. Until finish go, finish at least strong. Reunite back with Ghost. Bro, listen, yeah. y'all gotta have at least five seasons. At least minimum. five. And what are we on? Three. Yeah. We he ain't did shit yet. We don't. We can't just do one. He more. just. He's just feeling himself. That's. That's why we need Ghost back and just kill him. Just tell Ghost to kill Tariq. So he goes. That would be genius. <laughs> no, Ghost so kill Tariq. You just say and yeah, just come nigga, back and finish the show. What you thought, nigga? <laughs> yeah, finish the show. You fucked up. I, I set you up. And then Ghost and Monet work together and finish this whole. That's What's true. Tariq's name? Real name? Michael Rainey. Michael. I'm Rainey. telling you, he wants. He just. <laughs> it's pretty late. Um, oh yeah, I know. Were you going to Taco Tuesday? They already went. <laughs> what? It's been ruined. How much you think Michael Rainey makes an episode? An episode? I know he makes bread. Twelve thousand dollars an episode. What do you say? Fifty. <laughs> so it was twenty. Wow. At the beginning of 2018, he received a twenty-five thousand dollar increase, and now began earning forty-five. Forty-five thousand an episode, and he want to leave. That's not a lot, bro. It's not, but he's young. What? He's young, and his resume is not extensive. Did you hear that it said twenty-five thousand dollars extra? <laughs> yeah. They they, they, they more than double. Making? They more than doubled yeah, his, pay. Double his pay. So that shows you something. I mean, what's McCullough was making one hundred and fifty. Who? Ghost. Because that was gold. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he had a resume. And he had a resume. Coming off next day air and uh, Tariq was his son. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And I looks mean, like a son in real life. Pushing the forefront, though. I mean, they always knew that this nigga was gonna do this shit. So yeah, really, I mean, Effie bro, need to be making goddamn a hundred thousand right I mean, now because he's least making <laughs> she her sex scenes. Tariq really not doing nothing though. I know. He's not even he's, he's not like doing the main character, but he's, but he's not. not doing nothing. Monet should be actually making money for real. No, they're paying Mary J. Blige good, I'm sure. You think so? Let's see. Oh, I'm sure. Yo, let's find out. I want to know what niggas is making. Let's talk to motherfucking money. <laughs> That's what I say. And I know they... Never mind. I don't even want to bring his name. Whose name? Four hundred fucking thousand dollars. <laughs> I told you. No way. Mary J. Blige. Nigga. I told you. But she got four Mary, Mary J. Blige. No hell no. Because that means she's making like four million a season. <laughs> I mean, bro. It says uh, Blige reported paid four hundred thousand per episode. This is amongst the highest cable TV salaries around, especially for a woman of color. I know they pay her bread. Paid in the industry. Salute her. 
That's, I'm just saying, let's February think about 5th, it though. When Power came back, Monet was Monet. Everybody wanted to watch Power because, because of Monet. Because of Monet. It's and you know, BT, she got her own show coming on BT too. I didn't know that. But it's like a talk show. She said her monthly income is like roughly around 1.5 million a month. Yeah. That's why her husband tried to get That's why he <laughs> wants to leave. You can't get mad. You got to build yourself up. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And he, he wanted to hit her for her he alimony. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He wanted to chill. Did y'all hear about this, this Arab soccer player, nigga? His wife filed a divorce on him. She won half his shit. And then she found out when she did it that everything he owns is in his mom's name. So she can't get anything, but she's rich. He now can go get half of her shit. Salute to that dude. Got him. Nah, he got her. Salute to him. He fucking got her. Salute to him. Don't people sound like prenup or something? Yeah, but they don't have one. And it's in England. It's in England, too. It's not even America. He didn't have to have a prenup because when you sign all your money over or at least a big portion of it to your mom or whoever's responsible party of it, they can't attack it. They can't get you. Well, we could talk about six and seven if you want. Um uh shoot. Six Monet is she let the old boy kill uh Fresh, my man, Fresh. I don't know what his name was supposed to be. That's the actor from Fresh, you know. Um, legendary actor. We ain't seen him really in much in decades, but uh, shout out to him. She set him up for the smooth okey doke. Where did she end up letting it get back to the actual killer? So now the actual killer. Has been got, which is what's his nigga name, Enrique? You talking about the um, Enrique, Drew's lover? Yeah, yeah. So, man, Drew, um, Drew really surprised me. I'm not gonna lie. We know Drew's a killer. Um, a serial killer, of course. A serial killer. He's a serial killer by definition. Um, we know that a lot of serial killers um, are a part of the Rainbow Coalition. Certainly. A lot of serial killers, part of that impulse comes from uh, uh, some some psychological things dealing with, you know, being affiliated with the Rainbow um, that's documented fact. Jeffrey Dahmer, hello. Um, but how he just, I'll be honest with you. I thought it was a vision at first. I thought he was going to be in denial. Then when he even pulled the trigger, I still was in disbelief. Again, I was thinking it was like a vision or a dream. And bro, Drew did that shit. Yeah, yeah, bro. One to the heart. Call our own as they say in the Puerto Rican culture and Latin culture, Corazon shot his ass right in the heart, laid him down. Um, It's kind of crazy because, okay, so we knew Lorenzo Tejada was going to die. We knew that. Of course, this is power. People have to die. That's power, right? We didn't, I didn't anticipate Lorenzo dying so fast. I certainly anticipated his death. It happened swiftly. But then for the get back to just do what it did, war with the Russians, not war with the Russians, but to get back and 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 to have him get found out, especially at a key moment. Now, it was a key moment for him to be found out because he chose Drew over his family. Meaning what? He no longer has the backing of his family. His family's not coming to ride possibly because they dif- disassociated over their disagreement. So that's a key thing too, right there. Right or wrong? No, I agree. Right. So there's that. But then let's, let's just deal with the L and actually before we deal with that, let's deal with bitch ass, ho ass, fake ass. What's the nigga name? Trevor. Salim, his real name is like Trevor. Salim, I say fucking free, man. <laughs> the fake, and, and like Kane said, that sound like a made-up name. Yeah, it, it, it was, yeah. 
It was Salim Ashe Friedman. That was a bro. They be foreshadowing shit. That's a made up name, nigga. I was. I can't wait. Somehow, some way. He's he's who is he the new? He's not the new anybody, but he's gonna go. He's gonna no no. His level of bitch assness has is unprecedented in the power universe. Yeah, he's finna be uh Terry Silver. He he's about to meet the same fate as Terry Silver. You know he's what? Not, he might yeah. be the new Terry Silver. Yeah, that's exactly what's gonna happen. Um, I, the, I don't think the, gonna happen. the lean pack is gonna hit different. I want you to know that. Oh, it's, gonna hit different. it's gonna hit different. Listen, if it happens. I am so you don't understand how ecstatic I was. We got to make mention because I didn't. I got to talk to you about it behind the scenes, but I haven't got. Yeah, to we talk didn't to talk about. episode six. You was off that commentary. That's why I said we can talk about it. You don't understand the level of excitement I had of Effie opening that fucking door. <laughs> Me too. Ooh. Me too. We got to go back. We got to backtrack because before Effie opened the door, bitch ass Trevor Salim walked up to the door. And had to get the news that he didn't even subscribe to the motherfucking Stansfield Tribune. Is that? Yeah, stupid ass nigga with, with, with her guy. Yeah, no, with motherfucking uh, 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 Barney. Yes, with a, with a nigga. That's who. Didn't this bitch ass nigga said a poem? It was the corniest poem ever. I'm so I'm just so glad. Day. I'm so glad Diana didn't let that dumbass, weak ass poem woo her. Because right. let's be real, this is TV. This is television. So dumbass shit like that happens in TV. Mm -hmm. Right or wrong? No, yeah, this thanks. nigga came in. This dumb weak ass shit happens in TV. So I was just happy Diana really just was embarrassed that this whole ass nigga. And then he said her name. Yeah, the end, Diana. So now you let niggas know, you know, that we had something. That really ain't even nobody business in the first place. Yeah, I ain't like that. I ain't like that. Was that was his bitch ass way of saying that he he fucked? Exactly, and letting everybody know, and then making people feel like it was deeper than what it was. See, brother, it was deeper than what it was. See, I hated that nigga when he said, "I expect respect." <laughs> I want, bro. I want to snuff this nigga, man. I'm telling you right now. That bro. that that nigga was cosplaying a nigga from school days, nigga. No, straight up. He's playing Damon Wayne Sr. I'm dead serious, bro. He was playing. <laughs> Nigga was cosplaying. I mean, no, he said he's circumvent. I mean, circumcise. <laughs> he's a garbage. I'm, man, I can't stand that nigga. I'm, I can't stand Effie. I never, out of all his all his women, I hated her the most. You you have adamantly been on the Effie hate train. Um, ultimately, what we have coming to a head here and what I think and I, what I'm going to stand on is, you know, Tariq is going to get people uh, potentially caught up and go to prison. Um, he's going to have people take the fall. He just set up the Russians with with Councilman Tate. Um, I think they may be trying to set Effie up. I think Effie may be the fall girl in this. Did you see the preview for the next episode? I did. She's they down. said that. She's it, going it, down. it seemed like Kane mad. Kane, that's your new squeeze and shit. Okay, nigga. Well, nigga, the bitch is going down. <laughs> what, what you mad about? I can't like Kane. Hey, go put some money on the bitch books, nigga. <laughs> no, for real. You paid her tuition, lame ass nigga. So yeah, nigga, yeah. go trick some. Yeah, go put, you know, buy her some soups and coffee, my nigga. Uh, <laughs> but, but all this, like I said earlier, bro, like. He's really trying to get at Tariq, bro. Like, he really is jealous of this nigga Tariq, and he has been ever since he met him. I don't think that him fucking with Effie have anything to do with Tariq. It does, bro. It has everything to do with that nigga Tariq. I don't Effie, believe it. He, bro. It's, Effie gonna give that nigga the pussy up. I guarantee it. Well, I she guarantee has to it. at this point. Oh. First off, I paid your tuition. They're, listen, even, even the worst of tricks know... They need a sexual favor in, 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 you know, in exchange for tuition payment. Come on now. That's cool. serious cash at I Ivy League. That's fucking serious, man. Yeah, I think uh, Tariq don't really. Well, no, he said he loved her. He loved her. He's going to really throw her under the jail. When he sees that bitch fucking with Kane, he's going to throw her under the jail. 
And, and her and Sachs are going down. Book it. Book listen, it. Sachs well, listen. Is going down. Listen, let's talk about Sachs because here's what people have to understand. Number one now, Tariq knows Sachs is the fucking mole, right? I don't understand how niggas ain't been figured out Sachs was the mole. It's sat. I don't understand how niggas ain't instantaneously suspicious of every move that Sachs makes. Now he did get him off, but here's what everybody gonna have to understand out there in TV land watching. Cooper Sachs is one of the dirtiest, sleaziest, slimiest motherfuckers ever, and it's documented. So because it's documented, he is not a credible witness. He has there is there is a paper trail of him attempting to throw both the father and the mother of Tariq St. Patrick under the jail and him twisting, bending, and outright breaking the law in order to do it numerous times. Then he works. Then he goes to work for the defense attorney of Tariq and then gets inside and does that. On top of that, he just bribed a parole board public motherfucking official. What I mean to tell you is, Cooper Sachs and all of his testimony is not going to hold up in court against any motherfucking body, but especially Tariq St. Patrick. Go ahead. Yeah, but you don't remember when he was stalking Tariq at fucking school? At That's school. documented. That's yeah. documented. That's and, documented. That's documented. This can't, I don't know how they're going to introduce this, but remember, everybody, we're talking about a nigga who brought a gun to truth. He Bro, brought a gun to truth, and guess what? Here's the cold thing about him bringing a gun to truth. We all forgot about that, but Jenny reminded us. Now, oh, man. That, again, like you said, they foreshadow. That didn't come out for no reason. That may come back up. Sax is gone. I'd pin a fucking couple bodies on this. Yeah, pin a body on them. It's not impossible. Much crazier things have happened in this show. Who is that? That's hey, Ayash. Yo. Get on camera, man. What's going on? There we go. Go ahead, man. We talking about Cooper bitch ass sacks. Oh uh, man, he's definitely gonna be part of the fall guy in this in this next coming couple episodes. He's gonna have to because he, he's too dirty to really be an effective witness. And and the DA already threatened him to throw him under the bus too. She, he don't she don't uh, he don't help her. So it's like it's a catch twenty two. Like you damn if you do, damn if you don't. And he 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 messed up taking the cash to the dude because he he's on record for that. It, it's not going to tie back to uh to um to McLean. Davis. The mess. Yeah, to Davis. Davis. Davis McLean, and, and here's how you can frame it as Davis McLean. Hey, I put sacks on the job. This is my brother. I wanted my brother out of jail. He went, this is what he did, unbeknownst to me. Exactly. Now he's totally discredited. He's done. Lawrence switched. You got no witnesses now. Now, guess what? You, you've tied three different cocaine. That's circumstantial evidence. Braden is already admitted to running dope. So if anything, Braden's the what Tariq. Here's the here's what Tariq got going for him right now. With if if Sachs is disqualified and Lauren don't testify, Tariq hands are clean. That His part. fingerprints ain't on shit right now. Yep, yeah. none of the bodies gonna stick. None of the bodies gonna stick. Braden's family is so fucking rich; it doesn't even matter, exactly. right? Go ahead, Asad. What? Hold on, bro. What fingerprints were? Hold on, isn't Tariq on video at the uh, uh, Dante Spears murder at the scene? Yeah, yep. They they can't say he killed him though. No. Yeah, that's circumstantial, but fuck, nigga, there's so. <laughs> now much. listen, listen. All of the circuit, we gotta remember, all of the circumstantial evidence is not enough. We're talking about, and again. Here, here's the thing about this whole thing as well. You got this bitch, Jenny, whatever the bitch name is. You got this fucking <laughs> bitch, Blanca. Okay. I fucking hate and Blanca. You, got, you got people who have a hard on for the St. Patrick family. These people who they're getting ready to take it to, number one, it's already risky. Number one, you're over here, a, a oh. child whose mother has testified, you know, all this shit. You guys have continually came at him and you continually came at his father and have gotten nothing, right? 
So they may be reluctant to press forward, especially without the cooperation of Lawrence. Yeah, Tyreek Tyreek did it solid by by letting her hear that uh, audio. He's smart. He's smart. And yeah, now we got someone on the inside. Exactly. And Lauren don't want to go to Witsec. She ain't trying to be in the witness protection. No, yeah. He was smart by pointing that out mm -hmm. to her that nigga, you're not gonna be able to live a life if you're in Witsec. Yeah, it's over probably. with. Yeah, I think that little scene they show with Effie running. Because, you know, the, the, all, all the dope is at Wesson Holden's warehouse. Uh -huh. Tyreek don't got to show up no more. Well, well, hold shoot. on. Yeah. Remember, though, it was at Wesson Holden's, but they had to shoot out with the Russians. They they recovered the dope. Where was that at? When the Russians came through, smoked them niggas. That's at, you're right. That's at a Wesson Holden's warehouse. That ain't oh, got yeah, nothing yeah, to do yeah. with Tariq. That's true. That's true. They ain't got nothing to do with Tariq. One. Listen, this two, is why I think it's going to. Two, no more. Where the fuck is your niggas at when the Russians is sliding? This is why I think it's going to happen now that you mentioned Noma. I was thinking about her right before you said that. She's going to have to clean up all of it. Because if they go to jail, she's going to kill them anyway because they can't pay up. But Tyreek, his hands is clean either way because Effie was plotting on her. She's going to probably find the picture that she got. Braden's tied to the building, so he can't go nowhere. And then uh, 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 Lauren and, and Tariq can just get ghost. You know what I mean? Yeah. And then and, and then when the Rico hit, the, 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 uh, the Tahad is going to get all wrapped up. <laughs> Diana's locked. Here's the cold thing about If I was Diana, I, it, what you got to do is put it on Pops right now. Pops is dead. He can't go to jail. Damn. Hey, look, he passed me to work. I just stashed it from my dad. Or she can play it on Effie, too, because Effie was in the same location on camera. So, and she did approach her with it. Hey, no, no, you're right. Fuck it. That's 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 what that's why Kane is mad because mm -hmm. Tariq, because but here's my thing, y'all. And I said this, Tariq, those lockers been hot from last season. They was hot already. Them lockers got hit already, right? Uh, uh, with the shit with Braden, when Braden took the fall for that, right? So I'm thinking that Tariq sent her there with the dope on purpose, right? Now I initially thought basically to just fry everybody and just he get out clean. Now it makes more sense. Send Diana with the dope in there. Effie's going to go back looking for the dope. Effie's going to come back there. It's going to be on camera. Now when Diana gets busted, I come to Monet. Monet. We got to say it's Effie, exactly. right? Exactly. Now Effie takes the fall for the dope. Diana go in there and say it's Effie. Effie take the fall for the dope, <laughs> right? With Braden, because it's fucked both of them because they tried to kill Lauren. That's how Ghost is feeling. What, what evidence do they have that Diana is selling dope at that at that school? Well, they, they have her taking dope to the locker on camera, putting dope in the locker on camera. Mm-hmm. Sure about but that? also, there's drugs being sold at school. But there's and, no and proof of it, though. Nobody complaining. Unless Buddy come forward, but I think they're gonna whack him. I think Diane was thinking about whacking Buddy yeah. before she. No, came we gonna smoke on that Celine. Are you sure they have a picture of her? You, you said what? what? You're sure they have a picture of her? Bro, bro, they, yeah, bro, they, 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 they showed her. it. Remember, they was at the funeral at her dad's funeral with the pictures, and they were like, "Should we blade this on him now?" Exactly. They got the camera up there because Diana didn't notice the camera. Effie saw the camera, so she didn't open it, but she was there saying that she, I mean, she basically knows what's going on. And obviously the conversation oh, with I'm, I'm Effie and uh, Diana, she approached Diana with, with, with uh, trying to help her. Go ahead. My bad. Is my shit lagging? It a was. little bit. Yeah, a little bit. Okay. Go ahead. Good now. Yeah. Nigga, we're forgetting at the end of the episode, the whole fucking Tejada family just got arrested. No. No, 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 no. Only, only Diana only got Diana. arrested. They only Diana, Diana, Diana got only. Yeah, because mm -hmm. only Diana's on camera with the dope. Oh, exactly. shit, nigga. Oh, my God. They just they just putting pressure on uh, Monet and, and the brothers. 
Okay. So, because when you see the next episode clip, it's only her in the, in the interrogation room talking to yeah, talking Diana, to the Diana, Diana, Listen, listen exactly. So, Effie's going down. Okay. There's oh yeah, she, she's out of here. He's fucked. He's gonna line her up. And I and like I said, I think Noma. Either she's gonna wipe them all out, or I mean, because she still needs the the dope to be moved. So if Monet and them don't get clipped immediately, obviously they are gonna try to clip them another way because they don't have Wes and Owens no more. Even though they haven't ransacked them yet, I'm pretty sure that's gonna happen. So like, I'm pretty sure that's gonna happen in the next episode. But if Tyreek is smart, if he wants to, you know, throw a wrench in their whole organization. They just move all that shit somewhere else. Stop selling at Weston Holdings and just get it work back to the Russians. That's what they should do. Hey, we got work for you. Since y'all shit got took, put all that shit on the Russians, had them sell it for him, and just be the middleman. But I know how Tariq's feeling. He probably wants to take them all down and say, fuck this family, fuck, fuck everything else, fuck the game, and, you know, go from there with her, him, and Lauren. I was like, were you just, I'm sorry, were you just laughing at what was going on at the bank? No. Wow. Okay. Midget. I don't know anything about, I don't know anything about that. They had midgets. <laughs> I'm on the power ready. Um, it's a lot going on on the power ready. Uh, It's a lot going on. That's all I can say right now. <laughs> this is crazy. Um, I think they're going to try to make Effie take the fall. Kane is going to try to stand in the way. I think possibly that's who Davis McLean is saying to put the gun down to. Potentially. Um, I just think... Uh, I don't think it's Kane, so like I was on mute. Bro, I think I, I think it's Sax. It could be. Go ahead, Asad. Tariq is finna drop a dime on Effie, bro. Because he did that with the Russians. And look at the preview. I'm not gonna play no audio. We should be all right. We're, we're cool to just if I just show it. Yeah. Gonna... Uh-huh. So look at the preview, right? Bro. She's running. She's running from the po- but she, it looks like because she got something in her in her in her hand. It looks like it's she's like a, it's a drop. Yeah. Oh, this is what you do. Give her some dope. Oh, because remember, he, she said, "Are you gonna let me back into the game? Like, are you gonna let me back in?" And Tariq probably gonna be like, "Man, she's fucked up." Uh, uh, Diana, I'm gonna let you back in. Nigga, got her. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You line her up. Now, yeah. now here's the thing. He owes the bitch. Woo. Let's not act like. She didn't drop a dime on him. Yeah, yeah, bitch. <laughs> the Bible says, okay? <laughs> what goes around, come around. Whatever a, a bitch, show it. The bitch, show it. <laughs> That's a fact. That's a fact. Hey, look, he owed a bitch. He yeah. owed the bitch. Mm-hmm. She dropped a dime on him. That's true. Facts. Yeah, she gonna get her ass lined the fuck up. I'm guaranteed. Yeah. I, yeah, Charles Barkley has some shit. Yeah, run. And again, if Diana come in, oh yeah, and she gonna go down for the murder of Lauren. Um, we're we're forgetting about that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The murder of Lauren, and you were running drugs in the school. Diana testified against that. Lauren testified mm-hmm. that she tried to kill her. Effie's done. Yeah, she's out of there. Swift. Bye bye. Effie's Real out of picture. <laughs> <laughs> Effie's the, no, but listen, Effie's the new Dre. What about that? Okay. She ain't she ain't she ain't done enough. I ain't gonna lie. Nobody on this show has done enough to be anybody <laughs> really though. Yeah, I mean, but Dre though, Dre was like a real sinister. Bro, Dre had like snake. I saw how many bodies Dre had. Bro, they said Dre killed like 13 people in the show, bro. <laughs> Dre was black as bro. Shit. I don't remember. I know he killed a few people though, but then no, he yeah, was okay. Effie, Effie, Effie ain't that sinister. She she just, you know, Tariq's little buddy, but she ain't on that type of level. She's Listen. sinister. What you mean? She took up. She tried to drown a girl. No, a that's night. one person. Though. I'm talking about she, one person. That's crazy. She not out there. She not out there squeezing shit like that. But she she's crazy crafty. But Tariq is smarter. You know what I mean? 
here's the thing. Effie Tariq got way go more down. bodies too. Effie's gonna go down, but there's not gonna be a Rico. There's not gonna I be. I don't think so either. I don't think so either. It's not enough. They don't have enough for a Rico. I mean, again, unless Braden go down, and Braden family got enough money to where this this that that is a problem though. That dope was found in a Weston family fucking warehouse. Mm-hmm. Well, no, no, no. He he he's looking to the garbage. I wasn't in the warehouse. I was just the trash outside of the building. No, no, no. Coffee, that was the outside the cup. building. The warehouse where they found the dope, where the Russians shot up. That's a Weston family warehouse. Was it? Yeah, he said it. Remember mm. when when he wouldn't let him in? Now here's the thing. Oh, you're right, 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 you're right. Mm -hmm. Here's the thing with that though. Well, how does um, how does Braden? Here's how this shit can go, right? This is too much, though. So I doubt this happens, but I'll throw this out there as a potential, right, just in case. Diana and Lauren tell on Effie. Effie goes down for dope and attempted murder, right? Her accomplice and co-conspirator is Braden Wesson, right, with the dope. But how Braden avoids jail time is very simple. He alerts the feds, right, about SEC fraud. Mm. In his fucking uncle. Mm -hmm. His uncle is committing fucking SC, FCC and SEC or whatever the fuck fraud, which is huge. Yeah. We're talking about Bernie Madoff level shit. Exactly. And again, he's embezzling Tariq's trust fund and the Tejada insurance policy. Right? So that's a big deal. I just saw somebody put this on the, on the Reddit, on the Power Reddit as well. Which this is a here's a dark horse savior for Tariq and all this, which is uh the billionaire nigga. I was thinking about that too. I was thinking about that. Billionaire. This fucking Tariq has a billionaire just at his aid. He's got Tate at his aid. He's got the top lawyer in the goddamn country at his aid. This motherfucking nigga, bro. It's power. Yeah, He's man, acquiring that's power. That's crazy. You that's know? a fact. That's I was thinking about that too. I, I got if okay. now I was saying if uh if, if the whole Western organization goes crumbling, not necessarily Braden, but from the top down, dude is gonna pull his funds out, take Tariq with him, you know, and he's he's clean still. His 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 because he didn't come up with the crash coin and shit, he just came with the delivery system. So his 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 hand's still clean. They got to try to pin the, the prior bodies on them, though, which is they haven't done yet. So that's going to be impossible. But other than that, you're right. Like He's actually good to go in almost every scenario, especially if Lauren don't say nothing about him at all, because she didn't really see nothing anyway. But it, it's all about what Sachs does in the end. And if obviously they can pin everything on Effie and uh, the Tejadas. Oh, oh, oh. Now, now, again, this plan could work. Diana tell on Effie, right? Lauren tell on Effie. Effie take the fall. Here's the problem, though. Because here's how she... Here's the problem, though. Kane, bitch ass, if he's so caught up in his feelings towards Effie, now he says, Monet, how about I tell the family that you really got motherfucking Lorenzo killed? Over fucking Effie? Yeah. I think you'll do it. It's the only card he has. I mean, but what, what would that do? Just keep the pressure off him? But what is... what? Why? If if I was Monado and he tried it, I wouldn't give a fuck. I'd say, good luck, proof. You don't have proof anyway. What proof do That's you true. have? That's but true. What, what, would, what would be the advantage in saving Effie over Tariq? He's a bitch ass nigga and he just wants to bitch. Okay, but nigga, Tariq, lover boy, he just paid her tuition. She didn't even kiss the nigga. He paid you paid the tuition, you didn't even get a kiss. Tariq can take <laughs> everyone down. You're right. But there's no there's no incentive for Kane to do that though. He gonna be looked at as a rat for right now his own family, first and foremost. He can't go back on the streets. Well, no, 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 no. He's not gonna tell the authorities that he's gonna tell Drew and Diana that. Oh, I see. Hey Drew, you just killed your lover when your mother the one line cuz up. Yeah. Mm. It's possible. I'm just. But he's not going to do nothing against his mom either, though. 
Well, he he's do? not going to do anything against his mom, but but to to start that, I don't know. It the really Effie, Effie should be taking the fall. Somebody got to go down right now. <laughs> but it is yeah. power, so everybody might skate. I believe just, they will. I believe they will. I can't Everybody but Effie going to jail this early. I mean, they, 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 it's, it's Lauren's word because, you know, Lauren, she going to try to pin anything on her. No, nah, but that's the thing, though. Lauren is going to tell on Effie. But exactly. also, if y'all remember, technically, she doesn't actually remember Effie did that. Uh, I mean, she did say it multiple times, though. So I mean. She's saying it because she knows it, but she doesn't actually recollect it. Brayden can step in at that time, too, if that's the case. Because well, you know I, his, his money is long anyway, so they, he he can go and fight his day. He's already he went on. He's already took the stand and admitted to being a drug kingpin. He's already exactly, there. exactly. But is I, that I, bigger I, than the SEC fraud? No. Do we exactly. want to look at exactly? Do we want to look at the? Because uh, I have the last three episodes, um, like the uh, the previews in like the in wording. The synopsis. Yeah. For real. Let's read the synopsis. So, hey, that's crazy. Eight, sacrifice is the next one. The feds apply pressure to get their suspect to flip. Drew's suddenly erratic behavior leads the Castillos to grow suspicious. As Tate prepares to go up against his political opponent, Harper questions his ethics. Okay, who gives a fuck about the last part? Uh, we've already talked about that. Drew, the, uh, the niggas might suspect that Drew killed... The, the boy, whatever. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay. All right. Episode nine, a last gift. What is they that? didn't give a shit right there. Effie is the sacrifice. They didn't even give a shit in that synopsis. But the title tells you what you need to know. And the actual preview of the bitch run it. Right? Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Tariq scrambles to get ahead of information that could incriminate the drug organization and jeopardize his family's safety. The feds Ooh. don't. The feds double down and set sights on a new target to aid their investigation. Wait, so they're looking for a new snitch. They're Davis. looking for a new snitch. Davis. It might be. Because they already put in the previews uh, the next one, Sachs blowing his cover against Davis. Nah, but David, Davis, I mean, they could target Davis, though. That's true. I saw saying, I think they're the going to target him. Privilege, you can't breach that. So no, they couldn't go to Davis. What do you mean? I'm not talking about him being an attorney. I'm talking about Sachs already snitching on him about the the, uh, the paperwork well, in his doctor. They're eyeing a new informant. Hmm. Who could the new informant? Effie or Diana, maybe? Because nah, they already got her in custody. Nah, hell nah. Right. Well, oh, no, 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 no. Here's the problem, though. Here's the problem. Them eyeing a new informant means their their other informants are useless. Yeah, Lauren ain't Lauren ain't budging. Lauren and Sachs is not panning out, so they need the new informant. Read yeah, that again. The feds double down and set sights on a new target to aid. Stop that. What that means is their boss denied Rico. Now they're looking for somebody else because Lauren ain't all that good, right? Or all they have is Effie. They don't have a Rico, right? So Lauren ain't all that good, right? And uh, 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 Sax has been discredited. They need a new snitch. Yeah, because all Tariq got to do is go up to Davis, but hey, Sax is ratting on you. Just play a role, you know, false lead him if you need to be, and don't let him in, inside the circle no more. That, that's easy enough. Because Sax don't really know shit anyway. He doesn't really know shit, truthfully. And what and what did they prove by finding the dope in, in the cup, the Brooklyn boys and uh, uh, the Castillos? Like, what does that prove? It just proves like, that they have – all it proves is they have the same connect. That's all it exactly, proves. Exactly, exactly. It's really all, nothing. All of the evidence they have is circumstantial. That all part, that's what I mean. They it's have not no really nothing. Guns. No, they got guns. they got Diana with work. That's it, and she can just be like, "Hey, that's Effie's small time." I got know, it whatever. from Effie. Yep. I got it from Effie. Effie killed Lauren. Mm -hmm. It's over with. 
Exactly. There's no Rico in that. There's no Rico. That's one per. That's a. That's what we call a single actor. Exactly. And and Diana be like, hey, I just I was scared of Effie. My family got nothing to do with this. And then even with Braden, with the Wesson family, he he can get out. He can get out from under that. No problem. They rich. They white. They got money. They got lawyers. <laughs> it's Wall Street. They get up. They get up from out from under that. Um, what you call it? Uh, uh. You want to read the last one? Yeah, give me the last one. So the last one is the season finale. Uh huh. It's titled "Divided We Stands." Oh, see that? Mm. So what, what? What? What's the division? Tariq, the Tejadas, Kane, and Effie. Go ahead. Tariq is forced to join forces with those who betrayed him to prevent mm. the worst possible outcome for everyone. To prevent the worst possible outcome for everyone? Monet. Effie and Braden is the only people that betrayed him. Yeah. So so, so that must mean, oh, I know what's going on. I know what's going on. With, with, with the heat, the new pressure is no one knows where the fuck the, uh, 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 Tasha and him is at. Maybe that's not that's not far fetched at all. As, as as fucking criminal mastermind as they make this fucking Wakandan bitch seem. But that's true because this this is this this what happened. Remember last episode, Tariq sent his grandma off to go link up with him. Mm -hmm. So they could probably trail her. And be like, oh yeah, I, I know where they at now. That type of thing. Because they were watching. I think of. Exactly, exactly. Already, so, so they just stayed on her. Follow mm -hmm. their ass wherever the fuck. Now they know where the whole. Now that whole thing is compromised. So now they got to reteam back up to please Noma. So, mm -hmm. so that means Effie can't go down. Yeah, at all. That means they're gonna try to make Effie go down, and it's not gonna work. So that that, that might be the new bullshit. Well, and then and then goes on. We don't know who the new informant might be. So that's the only thing that's tripping me up because. But it doesn't hold. They're, they eye a new informant. Didn't say they were going to get it. They're, yeah. eyeing, they're going to try to get one. Don't mean it's going to work. Well, it says they doubled down. So that means they maybe no, no, approached somebody no, they, before. No, they doubled, they doubled down on pursuing the case. Hmm. So that means that, that it's not going, they're not going to get approval for the RICO, but they're going to double down on it anyway and say, fuck our witnesses. We looking for a new witness. But who could be even... That's crazy. Tate? Tate, man, no. He's he's not snitching on nobody. No, but they're going to try it. Again, There's no. That's true, that's true, because he they did approach him, and he, he leaked some information to uh, Tyreek, too. So He did. But he did. there's no benefit in him doing that, though. There's zero, unless he wants to be on the news. Hey, we got some other drugs off the street. Hey, like, which is, why, which is why he's probably going to turn them down. Exactly, and there's no Rico with him any, either. He and, don't and know enough information. It. He's going to turn them down. The feds are going to hit a dead end. And the situation with Noma is going to overshadow everything as right. the conflict. Mm hmm Because she's just going to kill them all and be like, hey, I'm done with all you. Rico, exactly. we're not. And then the yeah. feds case is done if they, you know, that. Which is not going to happen, but just hypothetically speaking, it'll be over for all of them. No more case. Mm hmm It then says... Uh... Monet elevates her position within the business, reaffirming her power over the Tejada children. That doesn't really give us that much. How can she elevate her position? How can she be higher than she already is? Mm. She's already the queen pin of this shit. Yeah, I don't know. I guess we just going to have to wait and see, man. Or she make a play on Tariq? I don't know. Cause she really don't run shit, honestly. Tariq, and you know, I would say Kane is still the the, the neck and neck as far as the, the the street shit. But yeah, so she's gonna have to establish her dominance over all that. Yeah, that's the only thing I can think of. Cause Kane is her son; like he gonna fall in line for the most part. Tariq is the one that you know is the one she got to really like. Okay, rein in, cause you know he <laughs> she knows Tariq knows a lot. He just gives her what uh, uh, she wants to hear for the most part. But I really can't see it. I don't know what she got going on either way. Because she made a hell of a play the last episode. Mm -hmm. Pinning that phone on dude and getting uh, him to text uh, Buddy. So the only person that knows what happened with 
the father Lorenzo is dead, so she she pretty much good to go. Mm-hmm. Straight up. Yeah, it's gonna be interesting. Though. I'm excited. Yeah, it's gonna be it's gonna be a lot of action. Because even still, they still was plotting on Noma's daughter. You know what I mean? How's that gonna play a part in the all this? If that's the case, that that's gonna carry into next season. I believe so. Yeah. That's gonna carry. Basically, what is probably gonna happen is the again the fair is gonna hit a dead end. The situation with Noma is gonna get more intense and volatile, and it's going to kind of uh, 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 encapsulate everything and carry us into next season. Along with maybe a, a, a court case, possibly. Well, actually, no. They don't have a Rico. Yeah, that, I, I, I think that's going to fall flat. Yeah. I, I, the investigation is still probably going to happen, but maybe. Blanca, get- Blanca's going to keep up, going to stay at it. Because oh, remember sure. remember what, what Blanca, what brought Blanca into this. Y'all remember what brought Blanca into this, right? With luck. What brought Blanca into this was the, the Tariq's first body. You're right. The, uh, yeah. the cricket cop. Yeah. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. That's true. She was really was her- investigating Angela. You said what? She was really trying to investigate why Angela was. Uh, why she she was-, she was there investigating. She was wondering why the fuck Angela was there, and that put her hot on the case. Yep. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> man, power, man! What a fucking roller coaster <laughs> they've had us on. Hey, they got excellent, excellent writing. Excellent writing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's uh most of the time it's pretty good. Just wow. I mean, I didn't like episode one, but I've liked every episode since that of this season. Um and, but they always do this. Episode six and seven, they're always gonna deliver major shit on episode six and seven every season from from you know book one to book two. Six yeah, and like, seven like are this. always blockbusters. Yeah, yeah. These are some dope episodes for sure. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, for sure, for sure. But yeah, man, anything in closing? Hey, man, you got to watch and see. See if our theories pan out. Because this is one last thing. I think Lauren is going to be such a headache for him. They might just, I might say they're going to blow her cover, but I think she's going to blow it herself. And that's going to play a role in Tariq trying to reel in Effie and Braden as well because they didn't finish the job and they're going to find out, okay, well, maybe Tariq was playing us thinking that he was going to, obviously they already know, or she, you know, he thinks that they, they think that they killed her too. So if she pops it back up in the scene, it's like, okay, well, shit, she's pretty much dead weight now. She's, she, she didn't snitch on him after all. She didn't help him out, so why would they need to kill her anymore? You know what I mean? So that might be another angle if the case don't uh, don't fall, uh, if the case falls through. So yeah, the, yeah, the, yeah, the case is gonna fall through though. The case is gonna fall through. So the, yeah, case is, I, the case is gonna fall through. It's going I can just tell by that how that synopsis just went. The case is getting ready to fall through because, like you said, now they could be, but the way even ten was with with Monet getting dominance over the Tahada children, you know. Um, again, Diana's a girl. First offense. I mean, worst case. I don't know if they caught they I don't think they caught her with the dope though. I mean, was it just still shots or was it actual because they, they, no, took they the got picture. it on camera, but but again, if you see me put some dope, if you didn't catch me with the dope, that's true, that's true, that's different. You can't dope. say anything really. You don't know what that was. Yeah, exactly. Was dope. Was dope. Exactly. That's a fact. Any dope, you have to test it. Mm-hmm. That's a fact. So this That's whole thing point. could just fall flat, especially if Lauren just don't say anything. If Tariq said, hey, Lauren, you're going to just have to just tell him you don't remember. It's over with. Sax is discredited. You ain't get the dope. It, everything, you, they don't have a case team. They don't have any one person or enough evidence to 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 put an enterprise together. So that shit going to fall um, flat. That shit going to yeah. fall flat. Now, yeah, now that you said that, it, it got to be Tate. They try to go after it again. Cause it, you, cause you know, of the, cause of the, what's that? Yeah, exactly. Because the play, the play they just made on the dope, the Russians. It's like, well, how the hell did he know that? 
he said it was one of his brothers in the police, but we, they he, people in the police like that. We didn't get that tip. You exactly. So they're going to come and they're going to say, Tate, we know you know something about the inner workings. The Russians was beefing with them, and then they probably gave you the information. Mm -hmm. and we're looking for you. And he's going to say, fuck you. Y'all ain't got shit. I'm trying to become the governor. I don't have time for your bullshit. <laughs> that part. That's simple. You can't force me nowhere. You can't tell me to do nothing. And I'm more powerful than y'all even, so get the fuck out of here. Exactly. So that's so. just not going to work. They're going to try it. That's not going to work. They're going to fall flat, of course. They're going to continue that shit in the next season, I'm sure. We're going to have it still going on. All that good old bullshit, but fuck that shit. It's going to be Noma. It's going to be a persistent issue with Noma. That's what it's going to be. Um, I can't wait. It's going to be nice. Yeah, yes, sir. But yeah, we're going to close out with that all great promotion. Um.